what is it you can't do without? Hello, hello, you're listening to Well Intel Daily. I'm Annie Hood. This is the podcast that showcases why wellbeing culture matters for you and your business. More and more, there is a need to question our behavior and action. Is my consumption justifiable? Is this third plane ride in as many weeks defensible? Is it good for other people? Is it mindful of the planet? Manuel Moniz was the former Secretary of State for Global Spain, and he led the COVID response effort. He's now the provost, the principal of IE University in Madrid. I asked him for his thoughts on well-being culture integration and his vision of the future. The quickest win for better well-being culture in business is, in my mind, sustainability. Thinking about sustainability allows you to project into the future and to make decisions today uh, that will reap immense benefits in the future. And he has this to say about his vision of a world 10 years from now. I want to see a world that is more sustainable, where societies are less fractured and where there is a more widely shared vision for the future. And this is his view of why well-being culture is a business imperative. Well-being culture is a business imperative because it allows to attract and retain talent and it allows for environments where better decisions are taken, hence making business far more sustainable. How you and I approach our work and personal lives matters to our neighbours and to the billions of people we've never even met. The sustainable view that Manuel describes is a leveller. Will sustainable living and sustainable business in fact be the balm that heals the fractured society that he describes. Please follow, share, review and be well.